Today's truck held about 20,000 meals uh, from peanut butter, um, cereal, um, some, uh, some different items that are just easy to eat. There's diapers, things that people may not be thinking about, but you need diapers, baby wipes, uh, because you know people have not really had running water and things of that nature. Um, and certainly lots and lots of water on that truck as well. Um, as a society, we may always think that somebody else has it, you know, because in America, I mean, at home, here we typically have the government stepping up right away. Um, you know, when Hurricane Sandy happened, our governor was one of the first people, I mean, I remember that like, first day. That's not happening for them. And the idea of a Calvary coming has not happened. The Calvary is made up of us as fellow Americans. We are going to have to do this because so far um, they're not receiving the attention and care that they certainly deserve. My biggest fear is what they're feeling is forgotten. So I think for us, the biggest thing we can offer is a reminder that they have not been forgotten. In this city, we call Puerto Ricans family and friends. So, you know, we don't understand this and we're not going to be a part of anything that has us being still. We're going to keep moving.